today I'm putting the perfect NBA player on the worst team in the league. If you don't know, a while back I created the dream NBA player and tracked his career to see how he would pan out. But today I'm trying something much tougher. I want to see if this player can carry my Detroit Pistons all the way to a championship. With 14 wins and 68 losses in the regular season, it can only go up from here. Okay, so here's the player. We have Amdula, the 7'4 point guard, 99 overall. Let's look over his stats. If you already watched the perfect player video, you know how he looks like. But if you didn't, here's how he looks like. All right, so his body is Victor Wembanyama's at 7'4. And I think Wembanyama's like 190 pounds. Uh, that's still extremely severely anorexic, or not, that's not the right word. Um, skinny. But yeah, he's going to put some more weight on. And then for his attributes, I think I gave him like De'Aaron Fox's driving, you know, offense or whatever. But here are his stats, you know, 99 three-point shot. That's from Curry. Um, ball handling is from Kyrie Irving, who's about to go to the finals, hopefully. Uh, shout out to my Dallas Mavericks fans. You guys know that I'm a Pistons fan, but since I moved to Texas, I'm picking a new team or a secondary team. It's either between the Spurs or the Mavericks. Y'all in the comments below, let me know. Should I pick the Spurs or the Mavericks? I'm leaning towards the Spurs. But for the next uh, week and a half, two weeks, Mavericks. But yeah, back to his stats. Defensively, he's a menace. We have Rudy Gobert's uh, defense who crushed it against Jokic. Actually, he was getting cooked. But I mean, at the end of the day, they won, which is what matters. Athleticism, 97 speed, like all around. He's great. And I'm expecting him to help this team a lot. Our second best player is Cade Cunningham, Jalen Duran. And uh, we have some goals for the video. We have four goals, very simple, okay? The first one is to lead the league in scoring in one season, you know, very simple. Then we have to win an MVP at least one time during this video, a defensive player of the year, and then ultimately win this Pistons team a championship because in real life, it's not happening anytime soon. Which is why, like, if I choose the Spurs as my second favorite team, realistically, unless they trade for Trey Young, the Spurs aren't gonna win a ring soon either. That's why I'm thinking Mavericks for like the next two weeks, but I'm just, it's a dilemma and I need you guys' help, like for real. So leading the league in scoring shouldn't be too tough. It's not like he's a pass first player. If we look at his tendencies, I believe he's uh, uh he shoots first. Yeah, shots at 100. So we should be straight for tendency wise, like everything's at 100. Now the rest of our team, I honestly don't recognize some of these names. Like we got Fettuccine Alfredo. I swear I do not remember the Pistons signing him at all. Quentin Grimes, we got the Timu shop dude. We got Sassy, we have uh, Fly, Flynn, Lachie Flynn, Evan, uh, Fournier, Todd Gibson is still in the league, is insane. Stanley um, Uday, I think, and then Rodent. So yeah, interesting team. Honestly, I don't want half of these guys on the court, so I'm gonna choose a coach game plan to make sure that they don't play. I'm only getting 35 minutes. I should be getting like 40. I could load a rotation and I want to do like a six man rotation, realistically. Four stars, one always on, sure. Let's see if that's, that's the one I want. Yeah, that's not the one I want. That's def I'm getting less minutes, what? All right, bump it. We'll just have me playing 35 minutes. We got Cade Cunningham at shooting guard, Asar at small forward, Beef Stew at power forward, and Jalen Duran. And then Jaden Ivey coming off at sixth man. I don't know if our bench is good enough. Hopefully I can carry, bro. You know, leading the league in scoring. Let's just simulate this first game against the Heat. We win that. So if we can beat the Heat, we're off to a good start. I had 35 points, 21 boards, 11 assists, four steals, two blocks. That's legitimately a Nikola Jokic stat line right there. Even Kate had 23. I'm very efficient. I only missed five shots, went perfect from three. Oh yeah. Okay, let's simulate these next two games. And oh, we crushed the Hornets. How much did I drop? 26, 17, eight. And then against the Bulls, I had 34, eight and 15. I might break more than one record. I mean, low key, we should aim for this record. The total points in the season, Wilt Chamberlain set it with 4,000. The only time I've ever, ever seen this uh, been broke is in my, my career series. I broke it um, from simming, honestly. But yeah, 4,000 is gonna be tough. Uh, Kobe was the most recent person to do it. Actually, Harden was. I mean, look, this East Eastern Conference is not easy, especially in 2K. Like, we have the Celtics, the 76ers, the Cavs. Our only losses so far have been against, actually, yeah, the good teams. Even the Hawks beat us. So this is not guaranteed that we're going to, like, you know, sweep these teams. And not to mention, I'm keeping injuries on because, hey, Cade could get injured. It happened to him in real life. Injuries happen. As long as I don't get injured, we'll be all right. Um, but... 
Maybe I should hop into like a challenging game. I'll hop into this Celtics game right here. Oh, low key, we just got blown out by the Pacers by 20 points. Then we came back in and beat them by 40. Yes, sir. Yo, my stat line is ridiculous. I might lead not just in scoring, but in every. Damn, fuck, man. Statistical. Fuck, all right. Statistical category. That was not, like, that was so, that was bad. Wow. There's gotta be, like, a pill you can take that makes you stop stuttering once and for all. And I, I'll buy it, bro. I promise you I would. So, look. Up against the Celtics, we're 23-7. and seven. We somehow lost to the Nets. I don't know how we lost that. Um, we are all healthy. But if we look at the standings so far, just to get an idea, we're the best team in the league. So, yo, I'm, the perfect player is doing a great job in leading this trash franchise. And then it's the Timberwolves who... I feel like 2K updated the Timberwolves and the Knicks in this game after this playoffs, how they're doing. Um, so it's not going to be easy in the playoffs. I just want to hop in this game and just see, you know, firsthand what we could do. I mean, this is probably our, one of our toughest matchups in the Eastern Conference. See, they have the lead. Oh, yeah. I might have to hop in and watch this pan out. Okay. It's a close game. I'm going to hop in right about here, up by seven. I have 31 points, but Tatum has 39. He's cooking us low key. Let's, let's, let's watch this happen. So it's a five point game and Drew Holiday is guarding me. I'm a top of the key for three. Oh, come on. I missed it. But well, we get the board with Jalen Duran. Backing down Kristaps Porzingis and he finishes smothered. That's what I like to see. We got Isaiah Stewart guarding Tatum and me guarding Drew Holiday. That's like a whole foot difference between me and Drew Holiday. And I'm playing good help defense, but Tatum misses it. We can't get the board. I'm right there. I don't know why I go to the perimeter, but it's straight, bro. Jalen Dern is a dog. Jaden Ivey, I mean, he's all right. He's cool. But realistically, he should just be feeding me. He's going to give us a beef stew. Back to me. Okay, pulling up contested, and I'm like that. Okay, hit his face. Hey, man, I'm 7'4". I can't even see you. I mean, if that's how we're playing throughout the season, then I could see us being MVP, and not just MVP, but, like, one of the GOATs of, like, having the best seasons of all time. On some 2018-2019 James Harden-type beat. Let's go, Jaden Ivey. Give it to me. Or Asar Thompson off the screen. Don't shoot that. You can't shoot. I'm just I'm just being honest. You can't. I've seen bro airball more shots than make, and I, that's just... To be honest, Tatum is fighting for his life over here, man. Oh, why is he open? Jalen Brown for three. All right, it's over. I got the rock in my hands. I don't even know who's guarding me. I genuinely couldn't even tell you. Is that Peyton Pritchard? They got a four-footer on me. Hey, good screen by Beef Stew. Pulling up for three, and I, and, I, and I missed it. That was Sam Hauser, I think. I, you know, I know ball, so I believe that's Sam Hauser. And we end up uh, winning that game easily. Hit him, drop 44, but I had 39. That was light. I'm actually really excited now for the playoffs because if we play like this every game, we're gonna be we're gonna be just fine. But low key, I want to see what this Timberwolves team is looking like. So let's play up to here. If you guys follow me on Twitter, you already know I claim myself to be an Anthony Edwards fanboy. Starting, uh, I think it was like April 29th or something, I declared my fandom. So uh, from here on out, you know Anthony Edwards, that's my guy. He's gonna he's gonna be a Hall of Famer, bro. He's gonna be one of the best players of the next of the next 10 years for sure my favorite part about this team is that when we lose even if it's by two points to the rockets right we lost by two points i still dropped 43 um but when we lose the next time we play them we make sure we beat them so bad that they feel that they apologize for even beating us because yo a 50 point victory is insane and then we beat the wizards by 30 we beat the oh we beat the wolves earlier in the season by 42 points man 42 points. What happened to Anthony Edwards? He went quiet. Nas Reed dropped 31. And funny enough, Nas Reed was the X factor in that playoff series against the Nuggets. And what's even crazier, I didn't know about Nas Reed until I started simulating 2K24 and he kept winning six man of the year award. And I thought it was just a joke, but like, bro's a real deal. So March 27th, we're 60 and 12. We lost to the Pelicans. They beat us twice this season. I don't know how because Troy Murphy, the Trey Murphy the third, yeah, he's actually a solid player. Um, nah, everyone on this team is, is valid. These are all I could I could tell you. I bet you hit okay. This Robinson Earl guy, I don't even have to look. His name is Jamie, right? Jeremiah, same shit. Okay, bet. So I know this team inside and out, bro. I'm, my ball knowledge is through the roof, but I'm gonna hop in this game against the Wolves and just see what we could do. I I even knew a Jeremiah that I called Jamie all the time, so like that's why I said Jamie. But it's a close game in Minnesota at the Target Center. Um, Target's like one of my favorite places to go to, if you know, you know. We're up by seven. All right, 
Edwards has 34. Let me hop in. I mean, don't ever buy produce from Target. They charge out the ass for food. Like, you don't go to Target to buy food. You go to Target to buy, like, anything else besides food because they just upcharge like crazy. Um, this is just stuff I've learned, you know, over the years. But Anthony Edwards using that screen from Gobert in a pick and roll in Gobert. Okay. I was going to say, he has no bag, but he gets a foul. That was my fifth foul, too. Can you make free throws? No. Because $7 for blackberries? Imagine paying $7 for like not even the big pack. The small pack of blackberries is, is actually a robbery. But I'm over here going to the paint against a smaller Mike Conley. Flung that right over him. And I blow it. And then don't even get me started on blueberries. The one pint of blueberries is at least like $8. It's ridiculous. And Edwards, that might be the dagger. Actually, no, we're up by five. What am I talking about? But we're in a great spot. I thought we were down by five. All right, let's get it. Spin move on Mike Conley. Hand it off back to me. Jaden Ivy. What you gonna do, bro? I'm coming off that screen. Catch and shoot mid-range. Hey, a two's a two. Game is game. Actually, game is no longer game. That guy is, uh, he is <laughs> been on some stuff. If you know, you know. Edwards, though, he's gonna use that screen by Gobert. And what's he gonna do with it? Our defense is fantastic, and he still drains it. Fucking my favorite player. We can't let him come back. You know, this Wolves team is known for coming back from 20-point deficits. And what am I doing? Am I, am I good? <laughs> am I good? Jalen Dern, thank you, man. But, like, am I stupid? Edwards, back out to Cat. Cat for three. Hey, that. hey, man. Cat can shoot. He can shoot the rock, man. Off this screen. Oh, they gave it to the wrong person. They gave it to Asar instead of me. What are you doing? Jalen Dern, bro, he's in his bag right now. All these offensive boards. And he's saying you're too small. Yeah, man. Dude, my cat's meowing, throwing me off my game. I'm trying, I'm trying to lock in and focus. Edwards, you got six points in 47 seconds. Can they get it? Good defense by Jaden Ivey. Look at this, bro. This is what I'm talking about. And he still scores. You're my goat for a reason. Watch him get a steal. Oh, they're going to foul. All right, they're going to play the foul game. I don't want to watch free throws. Um, but we end up winning by three points. Light work. Edwards had 44. And I had 28. Yo, Jalen Duran with a double-double. Solid. So it looks like we had a pretty successful regular season by adding the perfect player to the worst franchise in NBA history. Let's go ahead and see... Uh, if we still finish out as the first seed, because I, yeah, we lost a couple games in the end here. Hold on, we lost a few games in the end. Damn, but I win MVP, obviously, I better have. So we got one of our goals, averaging 31, 13, 11, two and two. And then rookie of the year is also me, Cade Cunningham, six man of the year. And then I'm defensive player of the year. Does the Detroit Pistons players win every award? Hold on, what about clutch player? Uh, Paul Reed is most improved. And then Anthony Edwards is clutch player. That's 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 too bad. Okay, Jokic is out. Four to six weeks with a broken left thigh. Damn, I have never broken my thigh before. That's gotta hurt. Um, and then for us, we are the first seed in the East. But I gotta see, do we break the scoring record or lead the league in scoring as our other goal? And the answer is no. My favorite player, if you didn't already know he's one of my favorite players, I declared it on Twitter. Anthony Edwards, 2,700 points. We got 2,500. If we lost this record to anyone, I'm glad it's uh, Ant-Man. I sound like I'm glazing right now. I'm low-key. Like, I got to, like, hop off a little bit. My fault. Um, but, yeah. No, nah, I mean, he, he ended up leading the, sco the scoring record, which sucks. Um, but for rebounds, we were number one. For a point guard is insane. <laughs> it's a boner. You can, you can, you, you can, never mind. Assist-wise, we also led that over Harden. And apparently, Saboner is also an assist guy. And Tyrese Halliburton. Steals, it was Shea Gilgis, man. But blocks, it was Chet Holmgren. And uh, had the most turnovers. Tough, tough, tough. So we failed that challenge. But now it's time to win a championship. And we're going to be up against the Milwaukee Bucks. Now, just so y'all get an idea of how much of a difference my player made to this team, we were first in points per game. Our defense was the second best defense. And then, uh, yeah, differential wise, we were number one. Three point wise, nothing crazy. We're actually one of the worst teams when it comes to three point percent or three points made. I'm assuming though, rebounds and assists, we crushed it. Yes, yeah, second in boards. We were second in assists, tied with the Nuggets. Steals, nah. Blocks, third. Nothing too crazy, but our record speaks for itself. So this Bucks team has a healthy Giannis, Dame, and Chris Middleton. They're healthy. In real life, they were injured. Let's see if this makes a difference. Game one, we take it by how much? By eight points, still a close game and I had to go off. I had to get 18 assists, Dame had 37. Okay, game two, we take that as well with me getting 30, K dropped 30 for us. Game three, this is a big one right here and we take that as well with 
Oh yeah, my guy Kay Cunningham, he, he's cooking up. And we sweep him. Round number two is against the Hawks. If you guys know the 2K lore, Atlanta Hawks are the most OP team when it comes to Sims. But luckily for us, DeJounte Murray is out for a couple weeks, so he's gonna miss the first couple games. It's just Trey Young and then uh, Joe Johnson, Jalen Johnson, yep, and then our Nick Kongwe. I think we're gonna sweep him, to be honest. It won't even be close, just, just watch. Yeah, 2-0, 2 we lost the game? Trey had to drop 45 points and we lost. Okay, don't, don't win two of them now. Yeah, 3-1, they won a second game. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, what's going on? Trey Young had 47. Bro's paying off Ronnie 2K to like have this insane stat line. I got 20 assists. That's gotta be like a season record for sure. And then game number six, we're gonna take it. Yeah, we better have took it, took it. Trey chilled out there. And we're up against the Knicks, who should be in the conference finals if it wasn't for Tom Thibodeau trying to kill all of his players, bro. And then we have OKC Minnesota on the Western side. So let's see, we're all healthy. And the Knicks are, surprise, surprise, not fully healthy, but they'll be all right. They still have uh, Julius Randle and Jalen Brunson. Let's hop into this game by game here. We take the first game by only four points. We gotta be careful for Jalen Brunson. Brunson's a dog. 3-0, oh yeah, 3-1, mm, Brunson had 39. I'ma hop in this game right here against uh, this game five and just see what we can do. Oh, it's a blowout. It's not even a, a competitive game at all whatsoever, goodness. We won by 20 points, 33, 15, and 15. Okay, so we're going to the finals. What about the OKC uh, Thunder? Are they gonna win? No. I should probably hop in this series and just watch. If we're up against Anthony Edwards, that makes for a really interesting finals matchup. Uh, they beat us before, we beat them before, and Edwards low-key stole my uh, record for the seat. Hold on. My cat's playing with the robot vacuum. How do you even turn it on? Hold on. Like, you can't make this stuff up. My, I have a, a vacuum that is, is a robot vacuum. He literally somehow found the button with his paw that I've been trimming, and he clicked the button to turn it on. I don't know how he, like, this cat's not, a, he's, he's like a, he's like not a full cat. He's like part human. But yeah, what I was saying is like, this game, I'm probably gonna hop in and just watch. You gonna do it again, bro? Deadass? All right, this is huge, man. Legitimately, this is the situation that we're in in real life, but replace the Thunder with the Nuggets. They have to win game six at home, and that's what's gonna happen, right? It's a tie ball game. Shea Gilgis, can you draw a foul or something? Ah, that's Kaysen Wallace. Kaysen Wallace. Oh, yo, we're playing good defense. We're playing really good defense. Oh, hop step, and we're just too little. Nas Reed, my boy Nas Reed, handoff to Jordan McLaughlin is his name, I believe, right? Jordan McLaughlin or Caleb McLaughlin. I don't know, it's one of the McLaughlins. But anyway, what are you doing? He's, just, he's gonna chuck up a last second shot. Are you crazy? You're crazy, bro. There's no way. There's no way he shot that and he made it. That's like when Rudy Gobert did the post fadeaway. That's exactly what that was right there. Guard up, guard up. Shay, he drains one right back, okay. He's got 34 points. This is literally how he plays. He always gets 30. Respect to 2K for this accurate simulation. I want to see Ant cook up though. Rudy Gobert to Ant. Ant, you can say giddy, bro. Set that screen. Attack the paint. Oh, nice pass to Rudy. Okay. Shea, he has a wide open paint. Flashy pass to Chet. He blew the layup. Chet, what are you doing? Oh my God. All right, Nikhil Alexander Walker. He just turns it, almost turns it over. What are we doing? Rudy Gobert, feed Cat. Cat, come on, bro. Yes, sir. Post move, you gotta score, you're right. He's way smaller than you. And thank you, Shy. He's gonna go up with that, it's insane. They're, the contested shots that's going in doesn't make sense right now. Minute and a half left though, it is time for Anthony Edwards to make a statement. Oh, you had him, what are y'all doing, bro? They're being so hesitant. Cat's gonna hand off, no, nothing? Bro, what do we, <laughs> this offense is tough to watch, man. Okay, off that screen, and it was an illegal screen. Good stuff, Nikhil. Now Shea's gonna cook on the little guy. You gotta follow him. One minute to go. This is it. We need a big, big play right here. From either Cat, not Rudy Gobert. Rudy, you should pass the ball ASAP. Give it to Anthony. Set those double screens. Catch and shoot Anthony Edwards, and he missed it. I do not wanna play this Thunder team in the final. Ooh, ooh, Jalen Williams with the and one. Aw, oh, damn. I'm not trying to play this Thunder team, bro. Five points in 40 seconds. I need some luck on our side. I need like some BS shots to go in. You know how 2K works. Edwards, spin, half spin, layup. That's in. Okay, hold on, hold on. We don't gotta foul. We do not have to foul. There's a seven second differential, and we, are we gonna foul? No. Okay, we're not gonna foul. Smart, smart. Force him into a bad shot. Force him. 
Go Bear! Damn, yo, that's tough. Defensive player of the year just got cooked. That might be game. We have no choice but to go for threes. I don't know why you're attacking the paint. That's not gonna help. Unless we get an inbound steal. I've seen crazier stuff before. That's not it. Nope. All right, well, let's sim cast it and uh, we end up losing or the Wolves end up losing. Shea had 40, man, which means we play against the Stack Thunder in the finals. They are completely healthy. Josh Giddy's down to an 83 overall. After watching him play, not impressed, man. I'm surprised he was even like an 85 to begin with. But this is it. Can we beat this crack franchise? Game one, we win it by 11 points. It wasn't me that had the most points, though. Jaden Ivey had 29. Very efficient. I like that. Okay. Game number two. We take that as well. I have 56 points. Holy shit. 56 is nuts. I went seven for 11 from three. Man, I, I want a Slurpee, bro. I haven't had one in a minute. But like, bro, 56 points is nuts. And uh, yeah, the Thunder, they've just been quiet. Let me hop in this game three. Bro, like what's your favorite Slurpee in the comments below? What do you usually get? I mix the Coca-Cola and Mountain Dew flavors half and half. I put the Mountain Dew one at the bottom half and then Coke on top. That's my, my favorite Slurpee, but like, it's a tie ball game. Let's hop in. I personally think the pina colada flavor is, is just overrated at 7-Eleven. It used to be good, but they kind of fell off. Look, this is a big game because they can easily come back and flip the series around. Hey, I got to lock in. Shay, I'm a whole foot taller than you. I'm going to hit that lay. Josh Giddy. We got, oh yeah, bro. Sarge Thompson is a lockdown defender. Off that screen, Isaiah Stewart close out and it's too late. They hit a three to take the lead. I got to take matters into my own hand. Don't pass the ball, Doolin. Oh my God, did you see that spin move? Yo, yo, I've never seen the CPU actually have like a nice spin move. Now we just gotta lock up and do not give Shea any space at all. Yes, sir, I'm on there. He, sh he shouldn't go up against me, bro. Come on, you gotta pass out. Your best bet is to give it, no, 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 no. Four point play, God damn it. Why would he foul? Isaiah Stewart, you just, you just got cooked. What are you meowing for? Little, what do you know? I fed you. All right, three point game now. You see how fast things can change just like that? That's why you can't get too comfortable in 2K. I just bodied Shea and I missed the lay. Good rebound by Beef Stew. Okay, we have another shot at it. I'm gonna go for a crazy lay and hit it. Isaiah Joe, man, he's been on fire hitting the last two threes, but Jaden Ivey switched on to him. Not gonna make it easy. Yup, that should have been a block, bro. Give me that board, let's go. They still have a one point lead, we got, we got a score. Bully him, get out the way, and give me that lay. Should've been an one. But now things get interesting. Can we take, can we steal this road game and go up 3-0? Or are they gonna score and take this game? Chat's gonna set a screen, I'm literally taller than Chat. I'm not gonna be affected, and God damn, he is, he's good. Like, I don't know how he blew past us. I thought we had solid speed, but I guess not. One point game, you better give it to me. If anyone else even thinks about shooting the ball, I'm gonna assassinate everyone on this team. Jaden Ivey, there's no way you just, you, you're, Jalen Duran, please, dog, that was crazy, he almost missed the putback dunk, Jaden Ivey, what are you doing, who do you think you are, and that was so stupid, clock management wise, we didn't have to take a shot that quick, now they could get a game winner, and I have a feeling, knowing 2k, they're gonna let him get a game winner, I'm guarding up on Shea, don't let him score that, okay, my defense just saved us, and we just stole game three on the road, Great ending. Jalen Duran with the game winner. Bro, Jalen Williams had 37 points. Uh, Shea had 25, and then I had 37. What a game, man. There's no way that my player is so good. Yo, hold on. This cat, man. Come, bro, hold on. Chill out. Chill out. It's like he has the zoomies. You know when they, you know when cats use the bathroom, they have the zoomies? It's like he didn't even use the bathroom. He just has the zoomies like 24-7. Uh, actually, he's not nocturnal at night. But I was saying, we have a chance to sweep the Thunder because, of, literally just because of adding a perfect player. Um, well, here we go. Game four, can we do it? Can the Pistons pull this off and get the sweep? And it's looking like the answer is yes. We end up beating them by 20 points. I dropped 34, 10, and 13. And just like that, Shea had 12 points going five for 20. We shut that up real quick. And we just won the championship. I got finals MVP. And just like that, there's our answer. So yeah, adding the perfect player to the worst team is a guaranteed championship according to 2K. Hopefully y'all enjoyed it, man. If you want to see more videos like this, watch this one right here. I'll catch y'all soon. Peace.